Hello and welcome to the Docs Vids. Uh, speaking of vids, this Docs Vid is on Vid. Ah, how about that? So right here is Vid. It's a new, a new entry, a new class that helps make a video. So we've been running with the sort of the same video example for a number of years and it involved maybe I don't know 20 steps of putting together the various events and video tags and stuff like that in HTML5 so we've wrapped all of that up well you can see what it looks like we've wrapped it all up right here page code here's the code So we had to create a video element and append it and set various attributes um, and then wait on various event listeners and get rid of those event listeners and play and pause and blah blah blah. So there it is. And then we've added some wrappers so that we can access the volume and the current time and duration there and that makes up the vid class yay we wrapped all of that stuff up there that makes it easier i hope and do we have an example of that here in the docs yeah so here's a video uh, we can either pass the path in directly or set the path like so and when the video is ready that means it's created all that stuff we're going to scale it to the stage and that in this case it will be it will fit it into the stage and that's an optional key out of a color so with the the new key out on the bitmap because the video is actually uh, a zim bitmap playing in there zim bitmaps actually a create bitmap but basically we're constantly updating a bitmap for that video and that's what we're showing you on the canvas but we can't play that video until the app is interacted with. So we're making a pane. And here's the callback function right there when the pane is closed. So we show the pane, but when we close it, it will call this. And indeed, it will uh, then play the video. Yay! And when we mouse down on the video, we're pausing the video, sort of toggling whether the video is paused. That's a property of the video. We do have an example where we've added a bunch of video controls, but we don't have a video control component. We we made that custom. Shall we show you? We, we, we'll go into Zim here. Hmm. Under examples, if we hit collections, right there, collections, Zim Bits has that. So Zim Bits may be the easiest way is just have a look at it so I think it's the very last one there, there. so we press that here we are interacting with the video interaction there's the video playing and then these things are doing there we are pausing it rewinding it Woo! It starts it again muting it spinning it so this gives a demonstration that the video is indeed on canvas. Look at that. It's uh, spinning it. Yeah. That is how long the video is played, so it allows you to scrub the video. And I'm going to hit stop here. Stop. And it goes back to normal beat, huh? Okay, so that was one example of a video uh, with controls anyway, or that was an example with controls. Here is the assets example, the new examples for Zim version Zim 00. And when I press that, hello, I am Dr. Abstract, the founder of the, there's a video that's playing and I've just paused it by Zim JavaScript Canvas. Like that. And note that we've keyed out the backing color there uh, of that video. Okay, back to the docs. I think that's pretty well it. You do get a reference to the bitmap that's in there. So there's the file, the width, the height, the volume. Uh oh, oh, those are the parameters, yeah, methods. And here's properties. There's a reference to the bitmap right there, as well as the source, which is a reference to the HTML tag. And you can do various things on that too. You go and look at, uh, I don't know, some documentation on the video tag for that. 
And then these are the ones, the properties that we brought in uh, locally to Zim to work on, along with a couple methods, play and pause, and the key out. And that's the docs on uh, video. Yay! And there's a tip on video as well, which basically tells you roughly the same stuff. I am Dr. Abstract. Uh, you're welcome to come visit us at zimjazz.com slash discord, zimjazz.com slash slack. We'd love to answer any questions there or see what you're making. Come on in. Don't be shy. <laughs> Have a good day or night. Cheers.